Mastering is the final process in music production which allows you to add some final touches to your mix, polish it up and make it ready to be played on different platforms and devices. Mastering is also one of the most crucial and important processes in that if properly done you can enhance the quality of your mix and if badly done you can actually damage it and just make it sound completely bad. Mastering is also one of the most common issues to those that are just starting out. In today's video I'm going to be showing you how to master your song using this free and simple plugin and we're going to approach this video in a few steps. The first step is going to be where I show you how to download, install and activate this plugin completely free on your computer. This works for Mac and Windows. The second stage is going to be me showing you how to actually use this plugin to master your song. Hi guys what's up and welcome back to the channel. If you're new to this channel my name is Che. I make music production tutorials on YouTube on mixing and mastering. Consider subscribing, click that post notification bell so that you get notified every single time I upload a brand new video. Alright so when you click the link in the description it's going to bring you to this website here. Click on account right here. If you have an account with Plugin Alliance, all you have to do is log in right here with your details. If not, you just need to come here and create a new account. Add these details right here, your password, your email, country and so on. Then confirm your password and stuff like that. Once you've made your account, now you can just come here and log in. So let me just log in with my details because I've already made an account with Plugin Alliance here. Alright, so once you log in, this is what you're going to see right here. So this is basically my account and by default, you're given quite a number of plugins that are free to install. Just scroll down to licenses and plugins and click on manage your licenses. You come to this page right here and you can see all these plugins that you can actually install and activate. There are about 19 free plugins that you can install and activate. You can see it's full license, full license right here. It's not try or anything. So the plugin that we are looking for is master disk. So I'll click here. You can see full license uh, master disk right here. Come to installation right here. Click on that. Then in order to install, you need to use the plugin alliance installation manager to get it. You need to come all the way down here. Then you find download installation managers. So I'll click windows for me because I'm using a windows PC. It automatically starts downloading right there. So once it's done downloading that and all we have to do is simply install. So it comes like that. Then I'll double click on the setup, next, accept, then finish. So just like that, you're done with uh, plugin manager installation. So I'll just come here to Windows and search for it, which is plugin alliance installation manager. I'll just open this. All right, so once it's open, all I have to do is simply sign in with my details. Then I'll put my password, save my password then uh, stay logged in and search for master desk. There is this master desk up here. These are probably paid. Then I've got a free version right here. Then I'll click on that, then click on download and install. So this is master desk classic. When it's done, you can click on uh, build another to get back to this right here. So one thing that I didn't show you is on the filter, you can actually choose what you want to install. You can choose VST2 or VST3, 64 or 32-bit. Okay, once this is done, all you have to do now is simply open your door here. Let's say, for example, I want to master this song right here. I can just come to my master here and add master disk. I'll just click on that. I can come here. You can see this key right here. Sometimes it will pop up with a something saying you need to activate and all that stuff. So I'll simply click on the key. Then make sure you click on activate all licenses and I'll show you why. Then click on I am online right here. You have to be connected to the internet. Obviously I am online. Then enter my plugin alliance details. I'll put my password here and click activate. Then it will start connecting to server right there. So the plugin is now activated right here and let me show you how to use it. If you take a look at the interface right here, it's simple. It has just a few knobs. 
you've got the volume is what you use to actually add loudness to your mix to make it as loud as you want as you add your volume you need to be taking a look at the dynamic range here to make sure that it's around this green zone here because this is what considered an optimal loudness level right here with six being the loudest the red part here means it's too loud if you want to read more about this you can actually click on the question mark here and open that and you can go through and do a little bit of reading so when we come back here the first thing that you have to do obviously is the volume you start pushing the volume then you can also use the foundation here and you can also play around with the stereo enhance and the tone here but the tone also has these modes here this a b c and d you can choose which one you feel sounds great then just adjust obviously bright and a little bit darker on this side let's try to listen to the song and see what we can do the way they move so smooth but i come back among any one go can see back go na no i am a smile na magi ne wa ku pasa si and we no no bapu na che you go no Sasa so you can see this line that it's uh, going somewhere around this area here because this is where i feel like this is the type of loudness that i need but then to be sure i just want to uh, bring up a plugin that we can probably use to monitor the loudness pull up Yulin loudness meter this is a free plugin i'll leave the link in the description you can go and check it out so what i'll do is just put it on this corner and just see how much i'm getting here in terms of lufs <laughs> The way they move so smooth But I come back some on any one that go can see back go na no no I am a smile na magi ene wa ku pasa si ali genuine no no bapu na che you go lo I we I want you all yo But I come back some on any one that go can see you black mamba you a black mamba black mamba Alright, so when you take a look at this, uh, they advise that we stay within this green zone right here. But depending on the loudness that I was looking for, I feel like this side i was getting it somewhere around this side there's nothing wrong with you getting it here or you can use an actual metering plugin to see the loudness that it is giving you all right guys i think this sounds great for me you can try this plugin out i hope you've seen how to download and how to install if you enjoyed the video don't forget to give it a thumbs up because it helps the channel grow if you're new to the channel subscribe click that post notification bell so that you get notified every single time i upload a brand new video follow me on instagram at jdmg on facebook at jdmx genius let's interact there i'll see you in the next video peace